Speaking this morning will be President Stuart Rabinowitz, Director of Athletics Jack Hayes, and the new head men's basketball coach Tim Welsh. The last time we had a press conference like this was a very sad day, and my stomach was turning many different ways. Today is a very happy day. In fact, today is a great day for Hofstra basketball specifically, and it's a great day for Hofstra athletics because this marks our hiring of Tim Welsh, who I truly believe will enable us to move our basketball success to the next level. We found a coach that has won at two schools. We found a coach that can recruit in the metropolitan area, but certainly has the ability to recruit in other places and to identify talent and to bring those people to work with him so that he can develop them over time. Two critical things that we needed. And we felt good already. And those were things we knew that we saw on paper. Then Tim came in. And those things were complemented by his understanding of the student athlete experience, his commitment and his requirement of his teams uh, to do the right thing on the court, in the classroom, within the campus community. All things that we all want because those are the foundations to how you build a program and how programs continue to be successful. There's no, no better feeling. That's why you work every day, to get to that point. There's a lot of scope yeah. to get there, a lot of big things you got to do, but that's where we try to get to, and that's where we're going to get to. There's no question about it. And, hey, this place has been there, it's been close, and the foundation is set. You know, it's not like we got to come in here and blow up the, the game plan. You know, congratulations to Tom. Yeah, he's done a tremendous job, Tom Pacor, here the last nine years. And 16 years as an assistant. He, he and Jay built this place. And as I said yesterday to somebody, they're handing me the keys. Don't, I'm not going to foul it up. You know, I got the keys to the, to the Escalade. Like you guys probably want to drive one day. A nice Escalade. And I'm just keep it on the road. And add some, you know, get a tune up. Add a few pieces. Change a couple things here and there, because I'm a different person than Coach Pecora, you know, but we think the same. We're going to recruit New York. We're going to be visible in the community. We're going to be visible on Long Island. We're going to be visible in New York. We're going to be visible in the media. And we're going to be here for you guys, too. We're going to be visible on campus. And that's, that's it's a pretty simple game plan. If you do that, gather the people. And like, I don't have to rally the troops here. I'm going to keep rallying them. They're already rallied, or else this is amazing. This turned out here today. And so... You know, as I said today in the New York paper, we know where the bodies are buried here. It's not like I'm coming from Oklahoma. You know, I, I told Charles laughed this morning. I said, Charles, I even have already have an easy pass. I didn't have to buy one. <laughs>